Welcome. This is Mary Jennings, and I'm here to guide you through your experience in these video series, learning all about your Momentum Art Kit. This is the Elements of Art section where we will be discovering all about color, value, line, shape, texture, space, and form. Using the other side of your card that's included in the kit and the space that's provided, you will use all of your drawing supplies, your drawing and painting supplies, as well as your painting supplies to discover and experiment and play with the elements of art. So let's get started. First, let's start with color and value. You can use your colored pencils to uh, place primary colors together and then using about 50% coverage, you can use your primary colors to make secondary colors, such as green, orange, and violet. Now, there are some other things about color that you should know. There are complementary colors. Complementary colors are colors that are opposite on the color wheel, such as red and green. And if you combine the two colors, it grays out, as you can see in the video. So complementary colors are also uh, complementary or orange and blue, as well as violet and yellow. Create value scales with your colored pencils. Let's, let's work on some line work with your uh, regular pencils. The, probably the HB is the best and your marker. So this is a place where you can develop, um, you know, your ability to do organic lines, straight lines. You can create value uh, and it's just a great place to play. Now the second section, or the third section rather, is shape. This is a great place where you can learn how to make organic shapes, geometric shapes, you can color them in. You can actually see the importance of shape when you are creating artwork. It's not just simply uh, triangles, rectangles, and squares. You can make all sorts of different things and you can give them a different sense of purpose with color. Next is texture. Texture is kind of a funny thing because you have to sort of, I don't know, try to develop uh, a desire for what you're trying to do. You can make uh, a bark texture, you can make uh, a feather texture, you can make something look very soft, something very hard. And it's all about the, um, the uh, application of your pencil work. Um, and you can also use colored pencils to uh, make the same sort of texture. Uh, in this case, this is a wooden texture. So it's just fun to play. Try a bunch of different things. Um, you can do a brown bag perhaps, and that's a uh, crinkly texture. So in this section in space, we're really trying to determine um, a sense of placement uh, through our drawing. So in this case, it's a landscape where I've created a mountain ridge in the background. I've created a layer of trees that are in the middle ground, and I've created yet another layer of trees in the foreground. I've added the use of perspective to get a sense of space. Um, and lastly, we have form. Now form is really important because with the use of value, you're able to determine uh, the structure of form. Yes, shape is important, but that cone would just be a cone if it didn't have value and as well as using uh, the element of shadow underneath. So welcome to Elements of Art. I hope you will take time to practice. And next up is we're going to work with the pages that were included in your kit to create some pretty amazing works using all the things you've learned about your materials and your colors and how to uh, really implement a variety of techniques for art making.